Nice approach to her bridge. Nice even cadence over the bridge. Nice exit. Nice curl into the next Brit. I'm going to give her nines on her bridge. Okay, I'd like to see her let that horse. <laughs> Have a little bit more rain. A uh, little distraction there on the corner. I'm going to give her a score of a three on her tarp. Again, I'd like to see her let this horse put his head down a little bit more. He's asking to put his head down. That's going to help him adjust his feet a lot better. I'm going to give her an overall score of fives on her logs. A little hesitant on his approach to the water. Rider's doing a good job of looking out into her obstacle. That's going to help, is helping that horse be drawn into the obstacle. So with the bobbles on the entrance, I'm going to give her Scores of six on her pawn. A little bit of misstep there on the step up. I think if she'd give the horse enough rein, he would make those adjustments himself. I like to see this rider come into the middle of the podium so that she's walking over than the top. This is a good opportunity to learn how to use um, some mental preparation to get yourself back on track before the next obstacle. Get yourself mentally prepared after the little um, mishap. I'm going to end up giving her threes on the first walkovers and she made a really crooked entrance into her square and then had a little spook. I'm going to give her overall threes on her square. And this rider just now let her air out. So that tells me that she was pretty tense from the time that she came off of the podium. So we can work with this rider a lot on some um, sports psychology.